Diabetic foot ulcer is a, a breach of the skin, a complication associated with diabetes. There are a couple different mechanisms uh, that uh, are at play when, uh, for an ulcer to form, but it also, generally speaking, is an erosion of the skin. The biggest problem with having a, a foot ulcer is the fact that you know our skin is our barrier to infection. We live in a world filled with germs, uh, and one way to keep uh, germs at bay is to maintain intact and healthy skin. The biggest initial risk is losing that particular limb. You lose the ability to sense pain, it becomes neuropathy. Uh, then you have an infection, uh, which with the breakage of the skin, and then you may lose the entire uh, leg, and then it can cause systemic effects. A diabetic foot ulcer is usually not noticed by the patient because they don't feel the ulcer. But what you'll normally find is chronic trauma to the foot causing an open wound with underlying infection or loss of tissue where the patient is having trouble walking, is having trouble uh, standing, and is running into sometimes, like I said, pain. Part of what hyperbaric oxygen does to help us heal this wound is to increase blood supply to an area by a process called angiogenesis. Having the wound undergo this process allows more blood to come to an area. With blood comes oxygen, comes nutrients, and we're able to better close that wound. When treating a foot ulcer, one can expect to receive anywhere from 30 to uh, perhaps 60 hyperbaric oxygen treatments, the vast majority of which will achieve uh, closure at 30 treatments. Diabetic foot ulcers that meet certain criteria are covered by insurance for uh, treatment utilizing hyperbaric oxygen therapy. Hyperbaric oxygen is uh, very beneficial in wound care, all wound care, specifically with diabetic foot ulcers. By using hyperbaric oxygen, there's much less chance of having a wound infection, a wound breakdown, of having flap loss or skin graft loss, even tissue expander or implant loss. There is an increase of stem cells, an increase of blood flow, and an increase of vasculature to the area. I've had the good opportunity to be exposed to hyperbaric oxygen therapy for more than 20 years. It is truly important that you have team players that really understand what it means to be a team player. Working with a company like Hyperbaric Medical Solutions, uh, we have an intimate relationship with them. The feedback has been tremendous. Their care and concern for the patient is by far superior to any type of institution that I've ever worked with. It definitely results in better patient outcomes.